What up, what up, what up? This is Simply Simone Thick coming to you live from the shy, shy town. Happy New Year, everybody. This is my first installment for 2020. And um, I want to kick this off by saying thank you all so much for the love. You all have been fantastic. I've been getting all kinds of followers. I'm at 5,700, almost 58. And um, I started out in, in August with 750, and now I'm at 5,700. That is ridiculous, y'all. And I want to thank you all. I appreciate you so much. You have no idea. All right, so let me kick off my thick thought for today. And that is to discuss what the changes I'm making for 2020. You know, most people, when they do... Um, you know, the New Year's resolution, it's about losing weight, it's about making certain changes and sticking, kicking off the year, um, you know, usually better, like, I'm, I'm going to do me and all this other stuff, and, and, you know, they have this attitude, and I decided that I'm going to do something different, because I was in that same boat, you know, now, yes, I am on a health kick, and I'm trying to get my, my health straight, um, uh, the weight loss is an automatic thing anyway because I'm I'm working on you know tightening up my body. Um, yes, I have a fat ass, and everybody loves my fat ass, but I want to tone it up, you know, and stuff like that. So that's one of the things I'm doing. But as far as my attitude goes, I'm it, you know they say when you change your attitude, then you change your altitude. Okay, and so that's what I'm trying to do. I decided instead of doing um the new new year new me stuff i'm gonna have a different and positive outlook okay um i believe that when you change the narrative you change everything about what's going on in your life and so i've decided that number one i'm gonna allow god to order my steps you know i've been doing that but i'm i'm uh going deeper with it and I'm not going to make any decisions like that. You know, when it comes to certain, like, life-changing, shattering decisions, you know, I'm going to allow God to do that. Number two, in order to receive blessings in your life, you have to give up stuff. You know, so I'm giving up, you know, uh, negative energy. You know, I'm giving up uh, control. Because I always got to have control over stuff, and I, and I need to stop that shit. Um, I'm giving up uh, negative uh, vibes as far as people is concerned. I'm like, you know, purging my repertoire of people who just are not good for me. You know, and I, I had started doing that, but I'm really, you know, cutting people off. Because, you know, some people you just don't want to take into your, your next... Um, part of your life you know you outgrow people and um, so I'm trying to you know work uh, some of the things that my purpose figure out my purpose so I'm gonna do more journaling this year you know I'm going to let stuff go you know grudges and uh, stuff that's negative energy that's just messing me up you know because a lot of times when you hold on to negative shit it messes you up it doesn't mess up the other person because the other person that moved on and you still on that same page. You know, that's crazy. So I'm going to start doing that. And uh, most importantly, as far as relationships go, you know, I, you know, if a person is not trying to elevate me, then they're not going to be in my life. You know, if a person is not consistent about, you know, being a part of my life, then I don't even exercise any of that. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm tired of that. People jumping in and out of your life and, and not being consistent about who they are. You know? So those are some of the things that I'm going to do. You know, let me know in the comments what you what you plan on doing. You know, are you going to make a positive difference in your life? You know, because positivity begets blessings. You know, and negative energy attracts bullshit. As <laughs> simple as that. And I ain't trying to do that. I'm, I'm trying to elevate myself, guys. You know, I'm, I'm trying to increase my income. You know, I'm trying to, uh, you know, do some things that I've always wanted to do that I was too afraid to do. 
I want to be more free. I want to be more exposed. I want to be more transparent. And uh, so those are some of the, the thick thoughts. Um, don't forget my 2020 calendar is available now. The way you get to it is um, you go, on, if you look on my, you know, my, uh, what is it? My profile and click on Taffy Magazine. And then if you, once you go to Taffy Magazine, you can click on the, the Mag Cloud and it'll take you straight to the um, the web viewer and you'll get an opportunity to at least see the first two pages of my calendar right now I have a sale my digital is $25 I mean I'm sorry $15 wow the actual print is $25 the digital is on sale for $15 so you can get it digital now all you gotta do is uh, sign up for MagCloud uh, subscription and you can get the digital copy immediately um, and if you buy I believe if you buy the magazine print you can get the digital for free I believe so I'll check that and see if not um, I'll make that available um, so that you can get the digital for free just hit me up and I'll hook you up but anyway um, Taffy magazine I'm still looking for uh, women uh, for Taffy Magazine. And then also, you know what? I'm going to do a feature of men who love a BBW. So I'm looking for two guys to be interviewed and, and um, featured in my magazine to to show your pride and your, um, your admiration for big girls. So if you would like to be that person and be featured and you ain't afraid to let the world know that you love you a big girl, then hit me up in my DM. Ladies, 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 if you want to be featured in my magazine, um, I'll let you know what the fee is. Um, but you can be featured in the magazine. It's not expensive fee, but I, you know, of course I got bills. They got to take care of when I uh, publish a magazine. And it, you will get your exposure. It is international. And um, if you want to take your career to the next level, um, be featured in Taffy Magazine BBW. Um, hit my DM um, and let me know what's up. I'm going to put the criteria up today. And ladies, just send me your submissions. Um, you could either, you know, I am offering it to be a, a commission situation. So if you um, promote the magazine and you send people my way, you let have them let me know or you let me know who you send in my way then I will give you a commission on uh, the magazine. And it's a, it's a paid gig, guys. So let's do this. I'm looking for sponsors also. So if you want to advertise in my magazine, um, I'm looking for stylists, fashion people, anybody that loves some BBWs, I need you to hit me up immediately so that we can get this done. Um, my first issue is coming out in March. That's what my goal is. If I get the people and stuff like that, and um let's go let's do this shit i'm taking this to the next level this is simply simone thick positive vibes god's vibes negativity is thumbs down y'all thumbs down simply simone thick aka miss taffy miss thick as fuck for you that's what taffy stands for and that's it so peace and chicken grease Make it a great day.